Good morning, children. Welcome to Maths class. So, in Maths, we are solving the problems of Block Twenty Five, which is Introduction to min Money. Yes. So, in this, we have learned about the different notes people used earlier and what we are using now, and also the notes what people used earlier and what we are using now. Also, we have learned. And in the previous class, we have learned what is the value, isn't it? When some amount is given. Five rupees plus two rupees plus three rupees one rupee plus two rupees. In that way, if they have given how to write it, also we have learned, isn't it, children? Now let's see the fourth topic is how to pay if you are buying something and the cost of that thing will be there, no? So how do you pay that amount? Let's see. So what notes or coins will you see to pay the given pictures? Okay. So if you see, children, here there is a Chocolate, a toffee, which costs nine rupees. So, do we have a nine rupees note? No. Do we have a nine rupee coin? No, isn't it? We can't give directly nine rupees as we don't have a nine rupee coin or a note. Yes. And if you see the note, children, the first note, the smallest amount is ten rupees, isn't it? So, for this nine rupees, you can give ten rupees, and you will get back. The change one rupee. Okay, this is your change which you will get back. This is what you will pay, or else you can go with coins like five rupee coin, two rupee coin plus two rupee coin. How so? Five rupee coin plus two rupee coin will become seven rupees, isn't it? Plus two rupees. Seven plus two becomes nine rupees. So nine rupees. In that way also you can pay. Okay. Depending on your choice, okay. Next one, five rupees. So this note we don't have. We have only coins. So what we can do is, you can give a five rupee coin, or else you can give a two rupee coin, plus two rupee coin, plus one rupee coin, one rupee. So this also makes five. Two plus two, four. Four plus one, five. Five rupees. So in this way, you can pay. Here I have written five rupees, or else you can write it as two rupees plus two rupees plus one rupee. Also, it depends on you. Okay, children. Let's see the next question. So, what is the value of these toys? So here there is a toy. Here there are some coins and notes. Now we have to mention what is the cost, total cost. So if you take the the stuffed toy, the dog. This is a ten rupees. This is also ten rupees. So ten rupees plus ten rupees becomes twenty rupees, isn't it? So you'll write twenty rupees. Okay. And there is a watch here. Okay. Here you have five rupee coin note. Here five rupee coin. Here one rupee coin. So five plus five becomes ten. Ten plus one becomes eleven. So you'll write eleven rupees. Okay, children. So in this way you can write what is the value of the given toys when notes and coins are given. You have to mention in the numbers. Okay, so complete this in your classwork, children. If you have already completed, do it again so that it will be easy for you in the next next classes. Okay, in your next class. Okay, children, and coming to your homework, complete the volume book, children. Volume book three, page number fifty one, S four. How to pay? Okay, if you have already completed, it's okay, children. Leave it. If not, try to complete now. Okay, and with this, we have completed with our block. Twenty five also children. So happy vacation children. Bye.